This week, we take a look at early frost injury. On the morning of May 30th, many of our producers awoke to fields looking something like this. Although the plants may look bad, the growing point is still below ground and we need to wait a minimum of three to five days to see new tissue growth. These are pictures of the best and worst plants out of a single field. They're to help you find the growing point in your plants, just above the nodal roots. As long as frost did not come within half an inch of the growing point, survival is likely. In a few days from now, this is what we hope to see. A plant with the leaves browned off, but new green growth emerging. Notice the healthy growing point at the tip of the knife. Many producers asked, how is this going to affect my harvest, and are there going to be any yield losses? If all of the plants come back and we experience excellent growing conditions for the remainder of the year, harvest will be pushed back by approximately one week, and you should have no significant yield loss. These images help show the extent of damage within our area. Although it's still too early to tell, it seems as though soybeans and canola have fared the frost the best. In the next three to five days we will know the extent of the damage, at which time we will update you on the recovery of the frost damaged plants.